Hello, UND. This is President Andy Armacost, and thanks for tuning in for this week's video. Next week is a big week for us. It's where we celebrate commencement. And I find it so exciting to be able to honor all of our graduates during this week. This is what our university is all about. It's about preparing all of our graduates for life out in, in society and to do great things, taking their UND education and their experiences here on campus and putting them into practice. And uh, so commencement happens on the 15th. Tune in online to watch it, please. And uh, on the 1st of May, we had the grad walk over at the Chester Fritz Auditorium. And this is where we had a chance to honor each of our graduates. Um, we had about 500 or so people come through where we, will, we were able to bestow upon them the honor and the praise that they have earned uh, through their hard work. It was a great time. Uh, and speaking of great times, uh, graduation on the 15th is a great time for celebration where I would hope that all of our graduates get together with their family members and their friends to celebrate. Um, they want to bestow upon you the, the praise that, that you deserve, but at the same time, you need to bestow upon them the gratitude that you have for them getting you to this point. Um, so to all of our graduates, congratulations. I wanted to talk a little bit about the spirit of support and a particular case that I was, uh, uh, that was known to me that happened uh, earlier this week. Um, there was a gravely injured non-UND uh, person, a young man who was uh, on University Avenue and uh, had, had really bad injuries. He made his way to the front door of the Delta Tau Delta house at about 1 a.m. And uh, let me offer my thanks to Jake Borgen. Uh, Jake is a member of the fraternity and he came forth and truly helped out this young man. Uh, he made sure the emergency services came and took care of him and provided the, the support and comfort as, uh, as they waited for that help to come. And I had a chance to chat with Jake the next day. And what really struck me was Jake's concern for uh, that person's well-being, to make sure that he was going to be okay. And, um, and Jake just said, I did what I had to do. This is, what, uh, uh, this is what we need to do as good human beings. And so let me offer my thanks to Jake uh, for stepping up and really providing the support to this other person when they needed it the most. Your actions that night epitomized what I would hope all of us would aspire to be, and that's a caring a human being who looks out for the needs of others. And speaking of helping others, I had the chance to watch a talk earlier this week that uh, addressed the uh, increased violence towards Asian Americans that we're seeing nationally. And so let me offer my thanks to the four panelists, Professor Yi Han Chu, Professor Chi Ming Tan, Professor Julia Zhao, and uh, student, PhD student, Kimberly Tom. And the session was uh, moderated by Professor Tambaqui Bailey. So thanks to the five of them for sharing their thoughts. And they each told stories about challenges they've faced in, in our society and their thoughts on the root causes of the violence that we're seeing and also the hope for solutions that will help us get to a better place within our society. So it took great courage for them to step forward and share their, their deep thoughts and to, to be on the stage and talk openly about their experiences. I think it's important for me as the university president to make sure our campus is a place where that type of violence and disrespect just doesn't happen. And to make certain that all of our faculty, staff, and students find our campus to be a place of tremendous belonging, that each of us belong here at UND. And that same sense of support that was called for by the panelists and that same sense of support that Jake showed in his actions is the same type of support that each of us need to commit to, um, that we can respond uh, to minimize the risk of harm to others and, uh, and to really respond in, in a very uh, thoughtful and human way uh, to others. So let me finish by offering my congratulations again to the class of 2021. You have been truly awesome. The work that you've done, the hard work that you've put forward to get to this point is certainly worthy of our recognition. Go forth and make a difference in our world, in, in your chosen professions. And we know that you'll make us all UND proud. Together we are one. Go Hawks.